you find out your partner is HIV positive after marriage, what would you do? That's it, what I'm going to talk about today. This topic basically hovers on the on how knowledgeable are you on HIV and AIDS. You see, so many people get married without having a test. You know, you just get married because you're in love and you trust each other. There's nothing wrong with that at all. But by the time you get married and then you find out that your partner is HIV positive, what would you do? Because some people might, I know some people might want to say, well, that's the end of the marriage. The marriage ends there. But if you say so, don't you think it might be too late? What if you already got it yourself? So breaking up the marriage, will it make any, solve any problem? No, it wouldn't. It will not take the HIV away. So what am I saying? What I'm saying is this. Basically, in every relationship, it's built on trust. Yet, reality sets in. If you know you're about to hitch, you know, get hitched, check it. There's no harm in going check out each other. Go for a test, HIV test. It's safer that way, you know, and then you can take it from there. You could still marry somebody with HIV, pos HIV positive because there are medications out there you will not even know. People live their full life po with HIV positive. People live full time and they are very happy. They have kids. There are studies out there. There are researches, there are medications there to help. But if you find out that your partner has HIV, it's not the end of the marriage. It shouldn't be the end of the marriage. It's not the end of the world either. Because possibly you could have got it too. And then if you're lucky enough, you've not got it. Possibly your partner didn't know, you know. But what I want to say to you guys out there is this. There are help. We need to be aware of these things. You need to go and get aware of what HIV is. HIV is not full-blown AIDS, no. It can be managed and you can live a very, very free, strong, positive life, happy one at that with it. It could be a bit expensive on the medication, but still, it's worth it, you know, if you find the right person and you see you're really in love and you, it's worth to take that risk. I know back home people would say, no way, you know, they want to run away and all. I had a cousin some years back, back home. He died of AIDS. He never knew he had HIV and he turned into full blown AIDS and he died. But he got married and had a son. I tell you, the wife and the son are very healthy. They don't even have HIV. Somehow they don't, they, they don't have HIV. So there are the miracles out there. Things happen. There are help all over. So don't think that is the end of the world. If you find out that your partner is HIV positive, reach out to information centers seek help and you will get one your partner is hiv positive it's not the end of the world you can work it out